Speaker, I'm one of the estimated 250,000 female veterans, and I've spent the last four years raising awareness of this hidden community. I've been pleased to work with the Minister uh, towards establishing the first female veteran strategy. I've been chair of the advisory board. The evidence gathering has ended. The recommendations have been made. So could the minister let me know whether the term military sexual trauma, female military sexual trauma, will be acknowledged and included, and what date the strat strategy will be published? Yeah. Thank you. So, so, Mr Speaker, I really want to pay tribute to my honourable friend, who's been a passionate advocate for this. <clears throat> She's the first woman from the ranks to come to this place and she should be incredibly proud of all the work she's done over many years uh, on this uh, on this issue um, i recognize the unique challenges around uh, sexual trauma in the military of course i do i i've, I've said that before from uh, this dispatch box um, the, the, the strategy will be published before uh, summer recess. I know uh, she's waiting for it. I'm determined to get it out before uh, summer recess, um, and I'm, I'm hopeful that it will uh, meet the, uh, all of the uh, demands and the unmet hurt uh, in that community that has been unmet for too long.